Hey, how you doing, man? It's Joe D here. Um, I'm doing something different today. I'm doing this right to the web, so I'm doing this directly to YouTube. So we'll see how it comes out, bro. <laughs> okay, uh, you guys, let me know what you think, man. Um, in any case, this is my new iPhone 3GS. Um, it's gonna be backwards here, but uh, trust me, that's it. Uh, I have my camera settings slightly different, so it's gonna be a little backwards um, as you're reading it here. But it is the 32 gig uh, black, as you can tell. If it was white, the box would be white. But the box is awesome. It's this really nice, hard, well constructed, and I've had it since launch. So this is uh you know a, a pretty you know, I wanted to give a decent little know something about it because this is my first iPhone I don't know anything you know I didn't never had one before um but this is the little um key deal you get a little pin deal that you get to you have a sim card slot on the top of your phone and then uh this you'd use to open that um and then you have the uh, instructions and so forth in here okay uh, so let me put that away just want to cover that real fast just cover and then inside here would have been another USB cable which you can see here um, and then this little hole right here would hold the uh, little square uh, uh, 112 um, outlet so you can plug it in the wall and then earphones and they have a built-in microphone okay so you have the earphones of the built-in mic USB cable and the wall charger okay all in this nice little cool box and your iPhone of course All right. inside here uh, here's a picture of some of my photography I'm always taking pictures of my family <laughs> that's some of my photography my wife and my youngest daughter in any case um, here's all my apps I have about seven pages of apps going now. Um, just, I mean, it's just been so much fun putting all these apps on here. And most of them are free. The ones that I did pay for were only like 99 cents or maybe, maybe um, $2, $1.99. But, I mean, not not bad at all. Most of these were free. And free through iTunes. I, this isn't jailbroken. I, I'm not going to jailbreak it either. So just for your information um, but tons of cool apps on here uh, some of the apps that I do recommend are this tap tap revenge um, that one I think you do have to pay for or there might be a free I, I don't remember but these are just the apps paid or not that, you, that I recommend okay the amazon.com app is a cool app if you shop Amazon a lot it makes surfing Amazon I'd rather surf it on my iPhone than I would on the computer, to tell you the truth. It's such a cool app. Um, the ABC News app is cool. Uh, FedEx, if you do a lot of shipping through FedEx. I need to look for UPS and see if they have an app as well. Um, th in my local area, uh, uh, the uh, CBS affiliate, uh, KRQE, uh, Channel 13, um, they have a, their own app, so I have that on here. Not like it's my favorite station, but I, it's a local app, so I have that one. Um, gosh, there's so many of them. Um, Shazam is a cool app. Uh, those of you that follow me on um, on um, Twitter have seen me use Shazam before. Um, that's a cool app for finding, uh, well, uh, you know, finding music if you're out somewhere, you hear a song, you don't know what it is, uh, you whip out Shazam and it'll tell you. Uh, Yelp is cool, I guess. I haven't used it that much, though. Um, the Twitter phone is another... Uh, when, I, when I post pictures to Twitter, I like to use Twitter phone. I think it's better. Um, the other one that I use for Twitter is Twitterific. I like to use Twitterific for Twitter... Um, most of the time because I, I like the interface on it but and then it makes this cool little bird chirping noise watch oh maybe I haven't got any new tweets <laughs> 
but whenever you get new tweets it makes a bird chirping noise but uh, whenever I'm just texting on Twitter I like to use Twitterific but if I'm gonna post a picture the way that um, Twitter phone does it I like better you know what I'm saying uh, and then of course you have your iPhone down uh, you have your iPod down here and that's pretty standard procedure uh, you have your Safari your mail and your phone um, but I, I man I'm just really 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 digging this uh, AT&T has their own app on here so you can check your bill you can pay your bill and all that sort of stuff I, th there's even a Bible app on here look at that I even have the Bible on here um, that, that I won't even go into that um, AOL Radio, iHeart Radio, and Dan Patrick, dude. I'm, I'm a huge Dan Patrick. I'm a sports nut. Love Dan Patrick. DP has his own app. Um, so check check that one out, man, if you're into sports. I, I love Dan Patrick. Stream him live. I'm iHeart Radio. I, I, I'm a big... Uh, um, I'm from LA originally. I'm originally from LA. I was born and raised there. So I love to keep up with some of the stations from from back home, uh, even though I live in Albuquerque. And look, this is KFI 640 live right now. This is Bill Handel. Pretty loud too, huh? It's kind of cool. So that's the iHeartRadio. That's pretty much Clear Channel stations. So most of your Clear Channel stations are available there. The Skype app is cool. Um, uh, the TV.com app, you can get all your like CBS shows through there. I'm a huge Dodger fan, being from LA. Uh, so the Dodgers have their own app, the 213, as you can see. And this is all your uh, Dodger info and all that type of stuff. If you're, I'm a Dodger geek. Um, I'm, I'm a I'm a huge sports geek. I'm I'm a tech geek and a sports geek. I think they go together. Anyway, Fox Sports has their own app. Just so much stuff. And then there's the Compass, which is I think is cool. Uh, being that I don't live in a huge city, you know, like LA anymore. I don't live in Chicago, New York City. I noticed that the reviewers that that reviewed the iPhone, the tech reviewers at least, your uh, Leo the Porch and those type of guys, all kind of poo pooed the Compass, you know. But when you're not from one of those bigger cities you know a lot of people in smaller cities or rural areas we go hunting and and we hike and all that type of stuff a lot and so a compass is cool to have man so that you know for us in these areas we think compass is cool <laughs> but um in any case you have your youtube of course hello that's what we're on <laughs> um all your settings uh, the Wi-Fi is cool the 3G is cool it'll wear out your battery like a mother so I constantly have 3G off um, you can see there on the back it is a 32 gig uh, whoops it is a 32 gig uh, I don't know if you can if in any case it is 32 gig uh, the Apple logo you have the camera which is pretty cool Video on this thing is cool. Um, gosh, I just I just love this iPhone. It's been it's been great. Um, this is my first bill. When you get your first bill, it'll look something like this. You can expect your first charges. I've got the 450 minute plan. Okay, I got the smallest minute plan because I don't really talk too much, but I do a lot of texting. Unlimited texting. I got the. Um, uh, of course, you have to get the data plan when you get the iPhone with AT&T. You can expect your first bill to be somewhere in that neighborhood, bro. 153 bucks. <laughs> okay. Um, but that's with all the transferring fees and all that stuff, okay? But your normal bill, my normal bill for my plan will be about 100, $101. So that's what you can expect from AT&T for this phone. I got the like kind of matte finish anti glare cover thing going here. Um, got that at the Apple Store. Um, this is it here, the anti glare film set. Came with two of them. It was 15 bucks at the Apple Store. All right, if just in case you're interested. All right, so that's it, brother. Uh, I think I pretty much covered everything I want to cover. I'm gonna start getting into uh, the cases too. So I'm gonna review the case that I got separately. Okay? We'll see you guys. Peace!
Where am I at? Peace. <laughs>